How do you see Bader versus your friend Matt Mitrione, our friend Matt Mitrione, going? I think it depends which Ryan Bader shows up. If the Ryan Bader that showed up against um, uh, King Mo, I the think the Matt Mitrione second has knockout, a right? Was that the? Yeah, yeah. I think he has a problem. I think, um, but we know Ryan Bader's had a problem about which, which, which Bader shows up. The Bader we've been seeing of late is very hungry. He's dying to fight. He's doing a great job. Um, I'm not too sure. I mean, his wrestling is, is superb. He's got great wrestling. That's what he needs to use against um, Matt Mitrione. He needs to close the space. Don't give Matt any distance. Matt's a long, rangy fighter. He has a long jab. Uh, southpaw, very unorthodox style. Uh, he's got heavy hands and fast hands for a big guy. Um, his takedown defense is getting a little bit better. Uh, and he's on a hype train. He's on a hype train since yeah. the Fedor fight. So he's got a lot of, you know, he, he's very, he's got a lot of people backing him now. So we'll see. But I think on paper, it should be a uh, Ryan Bader should be able to take this away. But I also said I thought Fedor would beat him too. So it's going to be, you're going to have to watch it. We're going to have to watch, right? Oh man, I mean, we even got Chill Sudden versus Fedor next. Like, all these fights, I mean, I, I can't wait to see what happens on Ravels. My quick pick, guys, just so you know, I am going to be going with Matt Mitrione to win this fight. So, me and James have a little bet going on here, I guess, and we'll find out on the next episode of Gloves Off, which will be coming in the next couple of weeks.